It's Georgia's story. I was a kid in the Arkansas camp. I went to school in one of these tar paper barracks. The origami flower becomes the symbol of building something beautiful out of the ugliness. This fall, the curtain rises on Allegiance, a new musical inspired by my own true life story. The team behind Allegiance is doing whatever it takes to open a musical on Broadway. Here is our story. So good morning, everybody. Welcome to our first day of Allegiance. So I'd love to uh, first begin by welcoming everybody here to the heart of Times Square, where we are finally, after an incredible journey, ready to begin rehearsals for the Broadway debut of Allegiance. So. We're now in rehearsal in studios and we have four weeks to get the show on its feet, figure out all the staging, blocking, choreography, lines, and music. Throw out what doesn't work, write new material, and make the show better. And so it's a, it's a lot to accomplish in four weeks. We're still in the sort of the storming mode right now. There's there's a lot happening and uh, there's a lot of material, and it's coalescing still. When you actually start rehearsals and you actually move into a theater, you're inviting so many more people into your relatively. At that point, it's been a small family, but now you're adding cast. Um, crew, everybody becomes part of the mechanism and the, the machine that is your show. Uh, can you come into four? Jenny, my associate choreographer, who's amazing, and I have spent years creating some of this stuff, and it's just getting it out of our brains and putting it onto people and seeing if it works compared to two of us doing it in my little studio. So, you know, it's just figuring out like what's going to work the best for me, for the company, for the show, and for the team, which is a lot of sort of people and things to please. And you're constantly taking feedback and input in. Phil, I have a dumb question. Is there a way she can walk him over rather than having Kay cross yeah. together? There is this very real fear that you only have your gut to hang your hat on and you're in a hurricane. That's Broadway. That's actually theater at any level. The challenges are the same. It somehow feels super magnified. You know, it's my Broadway debut, as it is like all of our, the whole team's debut. And so I think we're all putting a lot of pressure on ourselves to bring our best out. You just have to be extremely adaptable and flexible and have not a lot of ego about changing things quickly because it all has to work in the context of the show. You can't create in a bubble. I really feel that Mountain's Heart is a questionable song. I, I love the tune, and I wonder if, you know, if, if taking another lyrical pass with your, you know, with your sharper pen. It's the, it's the lick that's wrong, right? It's this notion that we have to go to this abstract concept, 
called the Mountain's Heart, which doesn't feel like we do that anywhere else anymore, right? right? Correct. Yeah. So what's the theme mm -hmm. that, that that song is? Well, it's, the, it's them as a couple. Keep your eyes on me. We can do this if we're together. If we just stay together, don't let all the external things. Right. It's us. It's us. This is That's what you've good. been looking for. Why don't people send me their ideas? Because, <laughs> I mean, I don't, I, it's, I'd love to, like, entertain various ideas. And it's just really the chorus. It's really the chorus, right? It's, yeah, it's, yeah, it's the chorus. Send me lyrics as you do them, because I'm going to be working on the restructure musically in the morning so just if you, as you have stuff sent just send it right to me and send it to me and to Kong. I think being fearless it means more than trust just trusting in your own work. Being fearless means that you can trust in the collaborative process that it's not going to somehow um, undermine you. I think for everyone, the, the pressures of time are very great right now. We have three weeks to stage the entire show. It's brand new. It's not like you're staging Hello Dolly, you know? It's, it's all brand new. It hasn't, it hasn't been done and we have to figure it out. You know, you remake, if you remake one piece, then all of a sudden it doesn't quite fit with the other piece the way it used to. And so then you have to kind of take apart that other piece. And so it's just kind of, you know, keeping up with the tidal wave until you get something that fits together seamlessly. Out there. I'm start again. I should be out there. Don't spin it. And I should be out there. Far past the fences and wire. But I look like the enemy. So there's no way to climb any higher. Our people will need support now. We're out on our own. Make, Make a break. break. It's no time to come up short now. There is so much more at stake. I'm more than just a number on a beat-up luggage tag. Some nameless, faceless body in a prop. Sorry. So should I, should I even those two? Sorry. Nameless, faceless body, body in, in a, a crowd. crowd. Body. And if you want to do body in a crowd. I'm just trying to think with each song, with each lyric, with each moment, and we get, are we getting it right? Are we hitting it in the zone? I know the stakes are higher now than, than at any time before, but I need to get it right. We need to get it right, or as close to right as we can. Yeah, I, yeah, I have to rethink exactly. this song. This is an interesting time in the process because we are really in the weeds. Like, we're not anywhere near a run-through yet. We're so far away from a run-through, but we're, it's not the first day anymore. So this right here, like literally right where we are for the next week is the dense fog <laughs> of theater and creating a new show where I think everyone's like, oh my God, <laughs> we make it out alive. Mm.